Everyone between the age of 13 and 64 should get tested for HIV at least once. People with certain risk factors should also get tested more often. That's why, as a health worker, I text myself more often. HIV tests are available for free or at a reduced cost. The only way to know your HIV status is to get tested, as I'm doing now. Knowing your HIV status gives you the powerful information to keep you and your partner healthy. Kindly know that if your test result is positive, you can take drugs to treat HIV. If your test result is positive, you can take your drugs to treat HIV to help you live a long and healthy life and protect others. If your test result is also negative, you can take actions to prevent HIV. This particular test method is a rapid antigen antibody test that is done with blood, with blood from a finger stick. Remember, HIV treatment helps people to live long, live healthy lives, and prevent HIV transmission. So let's continue in this testing method. Hi guys, welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you and demonstrate to you how we can do HIV tests at home. Yes, as a medical personnel, from time to time, we'll check ourselves and check whether we really, you know, do the course of our work. We'll check our cell to know whether we have HIV or not. You know, constant routine check. So I'm constantly check myself as usual. So today I have my determine. This is the determine. This is the determine. It has been pulled already. Have pulled it. I can. I just put it now anyway. This is the determine. This is my unigold. This is unigold. This is determine. You know, these are the three tests I'm going to use. The three kits I'm going to use for the test, this is my unigo. So I will start now. Yes, so yeah. This is the alcohol pad. You swab your hand, clean your hand very, very well. Then allow allow it to dry. Then connect your lancet. Open your lancet. Give yourself a very sharp prick. Very good. Wipe out the first blood that will come out. Wipe it out because it might contain tissue fluid. That is why you must wipe that first blood out. Then allow the, the spirit to alcohol to dry up. Allow it to dry up. Then you press and drop it on the, on the determined strip. Very good. Then you use your buffer, the chase buffer to facilitate the rate of the chemical reaction. Yes, drop the chase buffer. This is the chest buffer. Then you drop it on a determine. Allow it to stand. Allow it to stand. You know, for zero to five minutes. Allow it to stand. You see? Allow it to stand. So from time to time, it's good for you to do your regular check. Because we handle so many samples in the hospital. We check ourselves regularly. So that's what I'm doing exactly. So if in, in reading this result now, if I have to double line, the control line, you have the control line and the test line. If there are two lines here, the test line and the control line, which means positive, which means I have to come up and use my Unigold. Unigold is another kit, you know. Unigold is another kit I'm, use, I'm using to confirm if it is positive or not. Do you understand? Then this is the tiebreaker, which is a start pack. Start pack is a tiebreaker, another kit that you can also use to confirm if you already pay HIV positive. So using only determine, determine only, determine is this particular strip. Only determine cannot say your HIV positive or you must confirm it with Unigold or start back. If you do this HIV test and this determine is positive, you must go ahead to use Unigold. You must go ahead to use Unigold to confirm truly if it is positive or not. Do you understand? If you either use a Unigold or you use that pack. That pack is another key confirm whether you're, you're HIV positive or not. So from what we are seeing in this result, this one is very, very negative. So it's negative. This HIV result is negative. Can you see it? It's only the control line that is there. The patient's line is negative. There is no line there. It's it's only one line that is there. Had it been there is line in this particular place, which means it's positive. So with this result, this HIV test is very very negative and another thing if this hiv test is positive meaning it if it has two different lines which means i have to use my unigold to confirm whether it is really positive or not so thank you for watching connect with me in my next video subscribe and like share to your loved ones god bless you